Felicia here. Thank you for joining me on my channel, The Butterfly Effect. Huge shout out to my day ones, all my foundation subscribers. Thank you, you are appreciated. Uh, all of my new subscribers, thank you as well. If you're checking me out for the first time and this reading resonates with you or I as a reader resonate with you, I encourage you to please share, like, and of course, subscribe. Uh, this is a general energy check-in. It's not going to resonate with all of you as there are a lot of you in the collective and that would be really weird. So take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Do not try to force to shoot to fit. It will only confuse your eyes. And I don't want that to happen and neither does spirit. So take what's yours leave the rest also please check your sun or moon rising or your sign in venus that may help you to connect the dots if it's not your reading that's cool click the notification button i'm sure spirit will have something for you at some point in time in the future or feel free to book me for a personal reading and all that information is in my description box all that information and more so take a look around you never know you may just find what you're looking for uh once in a while i like to show myself you know just so that you guys know i'm actually like a real person so yeah <laughs> I'm, a, I'm more of a behind the scenes person but uh just a little one-off you know a little one-off but gems this is for my singles single and ready to mingle single sexy and free baby okay let's see what we have coming towards you okay so hopefully it's not anything from the past or anyone from the past. Hopefully it's all new vibes, good vibes, new vibes, okay? So, Spirit, thank you so much for your clear and concise messages. I am here and I understand them. I ask you to bless the collective. Bless all the Geminis and the Gemini collective. I ask you to help them to move forward in life, to bless them in all areas of their life with abundance, health, because health is wealth, happiness, peace, love. And all of that good stuff. Spirit, what messages do you have for the Gemini Collective? Thank you for your messages. I'm here and I understand them. What is coming towards my Gemini singles? So it's starting to get dark. So I might have to turn on the light if it gets too dark. But we'll just go with the flow right now and see, see what it is, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the Gemini Collective? We have here Seven of Coins. Ace of Coins. Ooh, okay. Gems, it looks like you about your money. You about your money. Mm-hmm. Any more messages, Spirit? Any more messages? Okay, we have two of coins in reverse. Gemini, you about your money. Mm -hmm. This is the season of your money. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's pull some clarifying cards. Spirit, please clarify seven of coins. Please clarify seven of coins. <laughs> you have destiny. Four of water in verse. Ooh, we got all these cards wanting to come out. I'm gonna take this one because it flipped out. Well, so we have five of earth in reverse. Okay, spirit, please clarify some coins. Whoa, okay, okay. Oh, that's too much. I'm not gonna take all that. That's too much. Spirit, can I get clarification for ace of coins, please? Can I get clarification for ace of coins? All these cards want to jump out. Gemini, what, what's going on? You guys have something to say? Spirit wants to talk to you. Okay. We have 12 of Earth in reverse. That clarifies Ace of Coins. Oh. We have 6 of Fire in reverse. Oh, wow. Did you see that one jump out? And we have 12 of Water in reverse. Spirit, please clarify. 2 of Coins in reverse. <laughs> you have seven of fire gems your cards are jumping out jumping 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 mm -hmm. and you have ace of water in reverse this wanted to come out before so hmm. we will get into it we will get into it okay and we have nine of air 
Sorry, James. I just had to turn on the light. It was getting a little bit too dark there. Okay, so let's jump into this. Okay, so it looks like you're working hard towards something and it was your destiny. Gemini, you're destined to be successful, okay? You got seven of coins here. You got money. You got wealth. Uh, I'm hearing recognition. Mm-hmm. I'm hearing you're a star. Gemini, what you working on? Whatever you're doing, you are making progress. Your work is paying off. Uh, you are experiencing growth. Mm, it looks like the efforts of your hard work are going to be paying off. Mm -hmm. You are going to be receiving the fruits of your labor and it is your destiny. I feel like you started to see the truth about something. I, hmm. Gems, I feel like you were recognizing that something was holding you back and it was yourself. Mm -hmm. Because you have here four of water in reverse so there's something you're holding on to uh, some regret that you are holding on to uh, maybe you were looking at yourself uh, or being too hard on yourself about something uh, about working hard towards something I feel like maybe you you're kind of beating yourself up like why did I put effort or time or energy into something so what's the regret about Oh, that's what it is. Okay, so my gems. Spirit wants you to not be so hard on yourself, okay? We all make mistakes. Ain't nobody on this planet perfect. And if they are, I'm pretty sure they wouldn't come here. <laughs> no. I feel like you're starting to recognize that. And Spirit wants you to recognize that, okay? We're all going to make mistakes. It's not to, about focusing on your flaws, but acknowledging your weaknesses, but moving forward in your strengths, okay? You're not perfect, but there's still a lot of great things about you. Gemini, you're a really hard worker, okay? And that you have ingenuity. You think outside of the box. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, I just heard two faces, two places, two surprises. What is that, Gemini? Tell me. Explain to me what's going on here. Hmm. I feel like it's your destiny. What is coming towards you? It's all supposed to happen. It's all supposed to play out this way. So it's uh, Spirit is saying not to be too hard on yourself about uh, whatever is going on, the work that you're putting in. Uh, just be real about what you're doing and keep moving forward. Stay focused. That's what it is. Stay focused. Because you are going to manifest. Look at this. By you staying focused and you learning how to just move forward, go with the flow, accept yourself for the beautiful being that you are, you have Ace of Coins coming. Ace of Coins. Okay? Ace of Coins. Hmm. Now, I don't know why my, uh, my camera keeps going. Spirit is here. Spirit is here. Gemini. Okay? So, hmm, but you have, uh, you have good fortune coming in and, and it's, it's learning how to, you know, what's coming towards you, Gemini, you're going to have to learn how to balance what's coming towards you, whatever money you're making, whatever plans you're putting into place. Spirit wants you to learn how to balance everything out. Your, your success comes in, whatever you're working for, your prosperity comes in. It is a combination of material and spiritual abundance. That's why Spirit's like, you need to stop being so hard on yourself. Everybody has to learn their lessons in their own way. So what are you so, why you have your panties in a knot? Mm-hmm. It's okay. You're doing what you have to do. Ah, okay. A lot of you, you're just, you're just getting it how you live. Okay, that's it. But I feel like you learning how to be loyal to yourself, recognizing that you are uh, the source of your own stability, abundance, happiness, uh, the source of your own strength. You get your ace of coins. That's how your money comes in. A lot of you too, I feel like the spirit is telling you not to reconcile with people who are, uh, who are not loyal people you can't build anything with, people that are just out to take, people that are selfish as fuck, yes? Spirit's like, leave, leave their ass alone, okay? Because they're just going to drain you. They're coming around to drain your pockets. A lot of you, some of, not a lot of you, but some of you have, mm, 
Okay, I'm picking up another story here. Gems, you have someone coming in who wants to have a new beginning with you, but they're after your money. Mm -hmm. This person is not loyal. This person is not, is not someone that you'd want to uh, form any type of union with, partnership with, because no this person talks about you whoever it is they like to chat shit about you behind your back chat shit period who is this gems but somebody's coming towards you who is gonna come like they have something to offer you but really they have nothing to offer you mm -hmm. you're gonna have to use your intuition with this about uh Knowing when to have a new start with someone and when not to. Gems, I feel like this is what I was picking up for some of you. In the past, you were working really hard to be with someone or to be in a relationship with someone or to make something work, and it didn't. And you're beating yourself up about it and spirits like, cut the shit. It didn't work, it didn't work, keep it moving. Be real with yourself. Could you really build with this person? Could you really have anything with this person? Because this person shows up as they're not loyal. They're broke. They don't have no keys to no type of abundance. They're looking for a come up and they're looking for it from you. And Spirit's like, don't fucking talk to people like this anymore. Keep them out of your life, okay? No reconciliation. Whoever this person is coming back, they talk about you. They talk about you to everybody, okay? And anybody who will listen. So Spirit's like, fuck that. You don't have time for that. Keep moving forward. Stay focused. Because this person... You're going to have to use your intuition on if you are going to allow this person in your life or not. I feel like a lot of you are going to be moving to the left with this one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm hearing that Beyonce song. To the left, to the left. Everything you own in the box to the left. Mm -hmm. If I bought it, that's my... Mm -hmm. Please don't touch. Mm -hmm. Gemini, some of you, somebody is coming back around and they're, they're after your box. <laughs> Say it like it is. Mm -hmm. Someone looks at you as like a cash app. Yeah. Because you're working hard, you're stacking all this paper. I feel like some of you are doing it quietly. Mm -hmm. So you, so you're making moves. You're making moves for yourself and someone sees that. Someone's been watching your ass. Yes, they have. Watching. Some people may be talking about you, about the moves that you're making, or wondering what it is that you are doing. So they're trying to come back around. Whoever this person is in the past that's going to try to come back around in the future, you know what to do. You know what to do. You're not dealing with people who used to juggle you, people who do not make you a priority in their life, people that talk shit about you that you can't do anything with anyway. Mm -hmm. People that you just... There's no real solid, secure, stable foundation. Even for some of you, if this is a friend... You need to cut them loose. I feel like you already did, but this person is going to come back around because they see that you're doing good. You're on your come up. You're on your glow up. Mm -hmm. But your intuition's on wipe me down. Okay? So they're not going to get too far. I feel like you already know this. You already know that this person is coming around or someone's sniffing around. Or... Someone's going to text somebody. Hi, stranger. What's going on? I know how you're doing. It's been a long time. Long time. Right? And you're just going to brush them. <laughs> Gemini, you're going to brush them off like, nah, not today, bitch. Not today. Because you're in your truth. You know what you want now. You know what's good for you. You know who's good for you. And you know who the fuck is not. And that's it. You're seeing the bigger picture of your life. That's why you're working so hard. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing you're working smart as well. And that is going to bring in a lot of abundance for you. Let me pull some more cards for you, Gems. Spirit, what other messages do you have for Gemini? My singles. What's happening for my singles? Look at this. You're doing what's good for you, man. Mm -hmm. Some of you, you're moving into uh, career areas or uh, industries, starting businesses, humanitarian businesses. So these are things that are helping the planet, helping society, helping the world. You're, and you're doing things from a place of I'm being the best version of myself. And that's absolutely awesome. Go get your blessings, baby. Go get your blessings. Mm hmm We have love in reverse. You don't have love for this person, Gemini. No, you don't. You're focused on yourself. You're also learning how to love yourself. Yes, you are. You're getting there. You're getting there. That's why spirits like stop being so hard on yourself. Stop beating yourself up. Look at this. 
this, this is a major arcana this is perspective you have two major arcanas here love and perspective right so spirit is i feel like you're going to start coming into this uh realization that you need to love yourself more you need to be proud of yourself you need to own who you are and place yourself on a pedestal mm -hmm. this is going to help uh speed up transformation for you as well look at this yes you know that you need to work on what's good for you you a lot of you you're really focusing on being the best version of yourself and that's absolutely awesome uh, some of you, those in this collective that have children, your children are looking up to you. They admire you. You're doing a great job by them. Hats off to you, baby. Hats off to you. Mm -hmm. You're seeing that you need to focus on you. You need to focus on laying a foundation for yourself. You need to make sure your shit's proper. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this is your journey. Because look at this destiny. It was your destiny to be on this path. You see that? I can't make this up. I can't. To be on this path. This path of loving you, doing you, mm -hmm, and benefit benefiting from the proceeds of. Look at that. You're balancing yourself out, baby. This is self-mastery. You are going to get here, Gemini. You are going to get here of accepting yourself, loving yourself, focusing on you, putting yourself on your own pedestal, and staying the fuck away from people who ain't got nothing to add to your life. No value, no assets, just drama, stress, and problems. You're not even having that shit anymore. Oh, here we go. We got father in reverse. Geminis, you have mastered your emotion, emotions when it comes to dealing with uh, someone here. A masculine energy doesn't have to be but somebody who is jealous possessive envious this motherfucker over here who likes to talk about you behind your back this person who likes to come and act like they have something to give you and they have a new beginning for you all the time and they they want to move things forward but really they're really not trying to they're not trying to go there with you it's all a damn lie this person's not loyal they're not faithful mm -hmm. this person could get bad advice from people this is someone who thinks that they know everything and they know nothing they know nothing. But this is also someone who's not stable. That's what I was getting. Someone is looking at you like a motherfucking cash app, Gemini. Okay? Don't do it. Don't do it. Someone wants to come around because you're looking real, real good when it comes to your finances. And they want some. Because this person is not stable. They could be broke. Okay? They could be broke. Somebody, I'm hearing checks. Checks. Someone's checks got cut off. And they're looking for someone to supplement their income. So watch your ass. Gemini before you end up being someone's income supplement okay but you're not you're not even going that you're too smart for that <laughs> you're too smart for that you're in your intuition your intuition is on wipe me down baby you already know this that's why you're not fucking with this person anymore this person well like I said they don't have you in your feelings anymore I don't really feel like you have feelings for this person anymore you're not moving forward with anybody there's no passion there there's no love there mm -mm. No, if you have a child or children with this person, Gemini, they did not show up as a, the best parent. Uh, some of you, you could have been dealing with an absentee parent. They just weren't there. But now they want to come around, now you're doing good, right? The Mike Jones effect, back then they didn't want to, now you hot, they all on you. Mm -hmm. But it's not going to work. Not today. Not today, bitch. Not today. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Someone wants to control you, Gemini. Yeah. This person's coming towards you because they're trying to manipulate you. They want to control your shit. They want to control your assets. They want to control your money. Mm -hmm. Coming around like Gemini, I love you. Let's do this again. Get the fuck out of here with that bullshit. Are you crazy? Mm -hmm. Look at this. This person needs to heal. Yeah, they need to do their healing. Uh, I feel like this person may have um, a mental illness, but it's more like uh, emotional, psychological wounds. Uh, trauma. Ch childhood trauma. This is this person is I feel like you were dealing with someone who wasn't emotionally available. Ah, I'm hearing their mind wasn't sharp, right? So they could have just done dumb shit. But someone was dealing with uh, they're not loyal because they didn't really experience that or have good examples of that of loyalty. So it's kind of like they don't know what it is. So they don't know how to be loyal. Uh, this person has a lot of work to do on themselves, Gemini. I feel like you know this. That's why you're staying away from them, right? It's like, listen, go deal with your shit. I don't have time for this, okay? You see me over here working hard, building me? Yes. <laughs> you see me over here working on myself. Gemini, this is beautiful. You have come to terms with this. 
You've made peace with this. Some of you may have even forgiven this nigga. Yes, you have. Good for you. Okay, that's being love and light. That is recognizing that you are uh, a being of a higher vibration. You are being a higher vibration. That's why I love this. This is awesome. This is hot right here. This is hot. Mm-hmm. Yes, Gemini, you are being guided by spirit, by your ancestors, mm -hmm, by the most high to focus on yourself, to know who you are for yourself. Some of you, this has to do with you healing inner wounds, mm -hmm, you healing uh, your mental. And I feel like you have, you will get there because you, you master yourself. You're not in your head about stuff anymore. You're not allowing people to make you depressed or stressed or anxious about something, anxious about anything. Mm -hmm. A lot of you are recognizing or discovering what your passions are as well, which is absolutely awesome. This is what brings in bank. I'm hearing this is the ingenuity. Mm -hmm. Two places, two spaces. Passions, different passions. Okay, spirit, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing blue rose. Does that mean anything to any of you? Uh, spirit says you, you're unique and you are rare. <laughs> you are... I'm hearing unattainable, unattainable. Oh, okay. So it's recognizing that you are priceless, okay? Recognizing your worth, recognizing your um, uniqueness, uh, just who you are as an individual, like standing in that power. Of, this is who I am. Like it or not, take it or leave it. This, this is what's up. A lot of you, you're not talking to this person. No, you don't fucks with them, right? Yeah. And, and it's just because you, you know, you already know that this person's up to no fucking good. And you don't have faith in anything with this person anyway. So I don't even know where they're going, what they want new beginning with you. You're not doing nothing with nobody because you already know this person is looking for someone to leech off of. Yeah. There's no fucking new beginnings around here. <laughs> no, Gemini, you still need to work on this healing though. You are getting there. You are be encouraged. You are getting there. But some of you, you're a little bit slow to the punch, okay? Some of you, you're not forgiving this person for a minute, okay? There's no new beginnings here. You still have them up for the shit that they did. And it's okay. Take your time. You will get there, okay? It's a process. Healing is a process. Spirit, can I get one more message for Gemini? Can I get one more message for Gemini? Look at this. You've got your um, enlightenment. You know, like I said, you already know what's up. You already know what this person is coming with. <sighs> Spirit is in the room. My camera keeps like, it's on the fritz. It was perfectly fine before. Spirit's like, yes, yes. Tell them. Tell them, butterfly effect. Tell them. Okay? You've gotten some emotional enlightenment. This could have been from getting readings. This could have been from listening to tarot readings. But you already know. I feel like you may have gone through a period of time. I'm hearing a period of solace where you were able to go within and really look at things for what they are and what they, they aren't. Okay? Mmm. Gemini, who am I speaking to? Because spirit is here. Who am I speaking to? You know who you are. You know who you are. Yes, you do. But it's like you got this aha moment, like, you know what? Ain't nothing ever going to work out with you, so why am I wasting my time? Why don't I put my energy back into myself? Hmm. I just want to keep going. I just want to keep going. Yes. Integrity. This is a major arcana. You're doing what's best for you, and it's about damn time, babies. Good for you. I'm going to pull one last card of guidance and advice from Spirit. This is from the Whispers from Within Oracle deck. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you for your clear and concise messages. I'm here and I understand them. What last words of guidance and advice do you have for the beautiful Gemini Collective? Oh, everything is working out, okay? So Spirit said, affirm that everything is working out for you today, okay? Today, like right now, okay? Your life is about to improve, okay? I told you, Gems, you're on your come up. That's what's coming towards you. You're on your glow up, okay? Adopt a more positive mindset. Things are going to work out no matter what. The universe has got my back. I am supported. I am loved. I am protected no matter what. Trust that any challenges are leading you to a better path. Always, always. Find the lesson in adversity. What did you learn from this, from dealing with this, these types of energies? You don't fuck with them anymore. You don't let people like this get you in your feelings. They're not worth your time, energy, nothing, okay? Spirit wants you to raise your vibration to attract more of what you want in your life. 
okay? They say, well, I say, gratitude brings latitude, okay? When you're happy, the universe is just like, sure, sure you want more of that? Here, I'll give, give you some more. I got, there's plenty of more where that came from. I got to your back. So it's first like, keep your vibration up, stay positive, stay focused, and just keep being the best version of yourself. Keep striving to be the best version of yourself because you got this. Okay, gems, this is what I have for you, honeys. If any of this resonates, smash that like button. If not, that's cool, another time. With that being said, you have yourself a fantastic morning, noon, or night, and I will catch your beautiful energy on the flip side. Bye.